There's always been a connection between Harlem and Paris. And for me, this collaboration makes a lot of sense because of that. Twiles tell stories and um, I just felt like all the French Twiles that I had seen just didn't tell my story. And, and so the stories didn't really resonate. I think as an interior designer, I consider myself to be a visual storyteller. And most of the stories I'm telling are about other people's homes instead of my own. But, you know, when I designed the Toile, I was able to sort of tell my own story. The design that I came up with for Le Creuset is black and white. And I think people probably would look at it and be surprised that instead of it being a bold, bright color, you know, that we chose to go with black and white. And I just felt like it was the perfect complement to add to your existing collection of Le Creuset. Um, I know because I have all these colorful pots and things in my own kitchens, that adding the sort of black and white pattern into that, again, just brings in another layer, another point of interest. I really only want to collaborate with companies who, whose brands are kind of similar to mine in a way, in terms of um, you know things that are of high quality, things that are well designed. It's functional and works first, but is also beautiful. I've I've used their products for years, for decades. I don't hide them in my kitchen cabinets. They sit out on my range or on my countertop 24 seven because they're beautiful. They're functional and they're beautiful. And it's authentic to, to my life, to my lifestyle. So the idea of collaboration with Le Creuset was extremely exciting to me um, and ended up being a lot of fun. I think of of Toile as, uh, as like the little black dress of pattern. It's, it's classic, it's timeless, it kind of goes with everything.